Some other symptoms that might make you think, wow, do, do I need to be looked at for diabetes? If you're having increased thirst, and definitely if you have increased urine output, urine frequency, other symptoms can be blurred vision, dizziness, and later, uh, years later, typically, are tingling in your fingers and toes. So there are complications from diabetes. Let's say you've had diabetes for a while. What are some of the things that diabetes can lead to that we want to control? Well, we've all heard the term hardening of the arteries, and there are small arteries and there are larger arteries. So micro, small vascular problems with diabetes means that the capillaries in the small, in the tips of your fingers, in the back of your eye, and in your kidneys, those become damaged so that those organs don't get the nourishment from the blood supply the way they should. So in diabetes, you want to make sure you get your eyes examined, your feet looked at, and your, your doctor to take care of certain things on a routine basis. Yes, because diabetes puts you at increased risk not only for changes within the back of the eye and the retina, but it also increases your risk for glaucoma and cataracts. And as a family doctor, you take care of diabetes all the time as well as endocrinologist. Yes. Okay. Now, treatment. Tell me what, obviously, diet and exercise, which we'll get into, but tell me some other things. The biggest thing is to try to be more active to start with and, of course, diet. But um, there are multiple oral medications that can be used. And there comes a time when, unfortunately, oral medications aren't enough and a patient has to go to injectable medications. Some are non-insulin and some are insulin. But you can, if you pay attention to what you're doing, not everybody has to be on, an, on the needle or an injection to take care of their diabetes. That's exactly right. There is no cure for diabetes. It is considered a chronic disease. And once you're diagnosed, you will always have that diagnosis. However, you can manage your diabetes and even keep yourself off of oral, even one oral medication through diet and exercise.